Rubio's Coastal Grill closes over a dozen San Diego area stores. KSWB articles. More than a dozen Rubio's Coastal Grill locations across San Diego County abruptly closed this week, surprising both workers and customers. Below are your comments. Three years ago their prices were way too high. I can remember when the places were crowded every day. They continued to become more popular, opened more stores, and continued to raise the prices. Don't blame this on the economy, blame it straight on Rubio's. When you can go to practically any sit-down restaurant and get a salad, fish and chips for less than two of their tacos, there is something amiss. Fifty years ago I worked in a small place, and the owner taught me how, not everything needs to be big. Err, expand, and have multiple locations. I have been a to Rubius three times in 25 years. Nothing makes me seek it out, but I always have a good meal and am treated well when there, no comple. Ain'ts. I've eaten at Rubio's since the original Pacific Beach location. Back then they were practically the only location for fish tacos. Nowadays in San Diego fish tacos are available almost everywhere. Too much competition and a decline in quality is the reason some of these Rubio locations are closing. Gee. Of course simple minds will try to blame one person, but that's a simple solution. Sudden, unannounced closings of some locations is a pretty good way to alienate your customer base. Thus ensuring that all your locations will close soon. Blaming Newsom is childish. There are plenty of reasons they are not doing well. One is the quality of food has gone down resulting in less customers. Price being another. Higher rents in the high-end strip malls. But go ahead blaming the D's if you like. Please subscribe to my channel. And if you like it, please thumbs up.